Alright, so hey, hi, hello, and what's up everyone? This here is Joey with another case review for the Apple iPhone 5. Uh, today I'm going to review the Spigen SGP Tough Armor case for the Apple iPhone 5 or 5S. Alright, so just for the sake of this video, I put the case back into the box. So, when you open up the box, nothing special. It does say it includes jelly bean buttons and a, what else was it? A certificate of authenticity and in the case of course as you guys can see I bought it in white now this is the case other than that you know the usual you get the jelly bean home buttons in black white and orange and you know an uh, info brochure and then a um, certificate of authenticity all right let's put this on the side and get to the case so this is the case, I'm going to put the phone in here, um, just so you guys know, the setup of the phone, like this, I have the Glass TR Slim uh, screen protector, so it's not the Nano, it's not the slimmest, but it is in between, They're, they have three uh, sorts of screen protectors with the R, so the TR, they come in the regular one, the Slim and the Nano Slim, this is the Slim. Then I have a gray aluminium uh, home button, which gives great feedback, by the way, and then the case. So, for starters, we're going to talk about the buttons. The buttons, they give great tactile feedback. I don't know if you guys have seen my previous review on the slim, um, the slim case, yes. Um, the top button didn't give great feedback this one on the on the other hand it does side buttons same thing and the mute switch is very easily accessible no problem whatsoever the back of the case we have an exposed Apple logo so what I would advise you guys is to use a uh, back protector it's not a screen protector but a back protector if you want to protect your Apple logo that's what I did it actually came with the Glass TR Slim so it included back protectors that's the one I used on my phone okay now about the plastic back plate for the people who have seen my previous review on the Spigen SGP Slim Armor they would know that I said that the plastic backing was very scratchable this one on the other hand is much better improved um, it's very scratch resistant or at least more scratch resistant. It's gonna show uh, after a while, but I mean, it still looks pretty good for the couple of months I've been using it. So I'm really happy with it. Now, about um, the lip. There's like a whole lot of lip left over. I mean, I have the Glass TR Slim Screen Protector. If I put the phone face down on the table, on the floor, no matter where you wanna put it, I don't know. It, I mean, there's a lot of room left, and that's with a glass uh, screen protector. So I can imagine if you guys use no screen protector or just a flimsy little one like this one right here, I'm sure you're going to have more than enough protection. As you guys know, of course, it is um, compatible with any glass screen protector. The camera cutout is just like the previous, previous one, really tight, but I like that. I don't like it when I can see the metal bezel of the backing. So I'm happy they kept it tight and clean. There's no problems with pictures, uh, no washout, no whitey effects on the pictures, so all good. Um, on the bottom, as you guys can see, cutouts are more than big enough uh, for the speakers. Um, microphone lightning uh, connector it will work with most third-party connectors I think I don't have any but I mean if you guys look at it it's pretty big so it probably isn't any problem um, for me I, I think this case is a great design it is a very very protective case I've dropped it a couple of times not on purpose and I mean it always came out pretty good my phone still looks as new so that's good and actually Spigen claims that it's as protective as the Otterbox Defender and they use the slogan that it's based on a phone not on a box so it was pretty funny um, 
and actually I well until now it really stands up pretty well to that slogan so I'm really happy with this case it's my daily case um, you know and a great one because my phone is still intact uh, just something little about the case branding uh, for the people who want to know there's the Spigen logo and inscription right here and then there's one on the bezel where is it all oh, right right here but it doesn't say Spigen it says tough armor so for the people who want to know so uh, this is my new favorite everyday case uh, it's a great case I'm happy with it so I can only recommend it to you guys as most of you will know probably Spigen uh, makes great products and I will continue probably buying products from them and reviewing them, reviewing them for you guys if you want to, if you're interested. So I hope you liked the review. Um, and, you know, thanks for watching. Be sure to hit that like button down below. Uh, and, um, well, see you in the next case review. Thanks for watching, guys.